Hi guys, I'm doing my first book review for my first non-fiction book of the year. I chose In the Heart of the Sea by Nathaniel Philbrick. Part of the reason I chose this book was because I knew that the movie was coming out in March. It's a great, great book. I normally find nonfiction to be pretty dry. The story is just incredible and Nathaniel Philbrick does a really good job of setting you up and giving you a lot of details about Nantucket. The story takes place in 1821. It kind of follows Thomas Nickerson's journal and he was a 14 year old cabin boy on the ship. This was his first whaling trip and you know disaster strikes when the Essex was rammed by a 80,000, is that right? 80 ton sperm whale, twice. Their ship was going down, they had three boats, the 20 men piled into them and set out to the tip of South America. These men were stuck without food, without fresh water, some died of disease. Nathaniel Fairbrook also brings in the point of modern science and studies that show what these men would have been going through, like what their bodies and their mindset would have been with this level of starvation and dehydration. It's kind of unbelievable, honestly. What I really love about this book also is that um, it includes can you see that? Okay. It includes like depictions of the ship and it names the parts where the jib is, where the flying jib is, which I had no idea. But if you liked um, books like Life of Pi or Moby Dick, then this is a good read for you. I really enjoyed it. I hope that you do too. I think the movie is going to be amazing. Leave me any messages down below and of course I'll try to comment or write you back. Now where is the other map? Nope, nope, nope.